new feature of the Photoshop 2014 version point two. I'm not sure what it's going to be called, point one and then point two. Well, this is the new version that's released in October 2014. So first thing to do, just going to go over here to the custom shape tool, custom shapes, and there's an option up here, obviously a shape, pass and pixels, but what I'm going to use is shape, just quickly draw the shape. And the key thing here is the new view, new guides from shape. Just do that and you'll see it creates lovely little guides just using the dimensions of the shape. Quite useful, quick. And so what you can do, just going to resize that a bit and you can move that around. I'm just going to click that and you can see just as you do that, positions it, obviously snaps to that. Just snaps there and you can just go, and obviously you can create an alt, just hold the alt key down and just drag that across and again snaps to that position there. Very quick and easy. Now, of course, once you've actually got those, so you've actually got maybe this design now, you can actually also still, of course, go to View and then New Guides from Shape. And it uses the currently selected one. So it actually creates that uh, little block for it. So now, at any point, of course, you can just go quickly back into that and it will click nicely into place in the original design. Very useful. So maybe you, what you can do is, of course, I'm just going to get rid of that one. And I'm going to get rid of that. You can. I'm just going to quickly clear it as well. So if I want to clear them, I can actually say view clear guides and I can just quickly create a, some text once it lets me. And I've just got wrong font, so I'm just going to use a different font there. Just use, just use that one and just type something guide. Okay, guide. And now I'll just go to over here and I can go to view be nice actually if they had a touch up tool like in Illustrator for uh, text, but anyway, just go there. And I'm going to create another character there, right? Well, I've actually got that selected, so I can go there. I can again go to view and a new guide from shape, and I can go up to this one, of course, and just say view new guide from shape, and you can quickly create a an interesting sort of obviously you can change that now you can move that up there and decide that you want it in that area it actually lets me move it up it's gonna do it anyway get rid of that next thing to do I'm just gonna quickly show you view again clear guides and last thing just select custom shape now this is an angel shape from a graphic extras just create that again select both of them and you can do view new guide from shape so it's not just one shape you can actually do new guides from shape so you get the guide design you can see actually just splits it nicely like that quite an interesting sort of useful feature in some projects I'm certain hope you found this of interest thank you much